the old ones, Max Steiner and those, you know, Gone with the Wind and, and um, King Kong, his score was, scores are always sort of brought that classical style to sound movies. Bernard Herrmann, if you think about Bernard Herrmann, you know, the guy did Citizen Kane and he did Taxi Driver and in between most of the Hitchcocks. So you're like, my God, you know, that's, that's quite a career. Um, um, I, also like Jerry Goldsmith, and I remember Chinatown is one of my favorite movies too, and Jerry Goldsmith did a beautiful score, and I found out later that he did it quickly because he replaced an earlier score that was thrown out and had very little time and wrote this, proves that you can do something beautiful quickly. He wrote this beautiful, evocative, perfect score for, for Chinatown. Um, one of the people that this sort of Lesser talked about, but it was important. And I got to work with him once was Jack, Jack Nietzsche, who did One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. And uh, I love scores that try something different. So I remember the score for Cuckoo's Nest, there's a sound of a saw being played by a string bow. And something about that, who would have thought to have, a, you know, let's bring in a saw and play. It's perfect for that movie. It's really uh, great. And I worked with him on, on Hotspot. He did, and he, he, uh, he did an approach to the score on Hotspot, which um, was was great for me because he brought in Miles Davis and John Lee Hooker. And they sat in the studio and they watched the movie and they improvised stuff that seemed right for the feeling of the movie. And uh, that was one of the great experiences of my life.